alterations. For physical growth, alterations may mean a few stitches here and there. But for Judy, there was another kind of alteration that took place earlier this summer. They called her the water bug. It was Judy who got the others interested in the aquatic aid training last year. During summer vacations, Herb worked at a local community center. That day, he was explaining how they were trying to organize a swimming program. But the center had no pool and not enough qualified waterfront personnel for beach swimming. But there didn't seem to be enough time for serious conversation. was sure Judy didn't hear a word of what he said. Too interested in just having fun. But he was in for a surprise. Perhaps it was Judy's meeting with Dr. Campbell he stopped to tell her how pleased everyone at the clinic was with their work with the mentally retarded youngsters. Judy explained she wasn't part of that project, but that didn't seem to matter to Dr. Campbell. After all, she was wearing the same uniform. Now she had that old feeling again. She wanted to do something. Seeing that swimming pool did the trick. All the pieces seemed to fall together. For a while, Herb didn't see Judy. Something was cooking. Something the aquatic aides were calling Operation Dog Paddle. Then he found out. The aquatic aides were asking private pool owners in the neighborhood of the community center to give one day a week to the center youngsters so they could learn how to swim. There was hesitancy, but just knowing the girls were scouts seemed to make the difference. Operation Dog Paddle was a splashing success. The youngsters loved it and were put on their way to becoming safe swimmers. The Red Cross instructors were very impressed by the work of the aquatic aid. And so was Herb. Alterations. A girl's point of view becoming a woman's outlook. The uniform is a clean, uncluttered statement that the girl who wears it knows what responsibility really means. Doing not only the things you like to do, but the things others count on you to do. A woman's life is filled with activity. Mrs. Miller, like millions of others, keeps her home in good working order. She shares with her husband all the responsibilities of home and raising a family. Yet there's a sense of responsibility that extends beyond the immediate demands of home and family. Mrs. Miller is one of many hundreds of thousands of women who gives a very special meaning to the Girl Scout uniform. Wherever the adult Girl Scout uniform is seen, you'll find women who are taking an active role in preparing girls to become mature, responsible adults and good citizens.
The uniform has many meanings. A personal meaning for each one who wears it. And a much larger meaning. It is what each girl and adult does in Girl Scouting that gives the uniform its real meaning. In the community, the nation, and throughout the world. Thank you.